Hello everyone, Trigon here. Welcome back to Transport Fever 2. Don't forget if you like this video, tick that thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. As you can see, I did a little work here. This is our main corridor route. Um, the work we did, the adding the southern corridor has worked really well. There's a lot of traffic going down there in the southern corridor. Not nearly what there is on the main corridor, but still quite a lot. Um, but it, there was so much additional uh, uh, freight that needed to, to be routed off this corridor that even with all that stuff pulled off from there, I'm still um, I'm still needing all the same number of trains. And so we were still having the same backup. I'm going to pause this for a second. We still had the same backup of uh, uh, trains. So I doubled the number of tracks. So there's now, for, for most of the route, except for the last leg out to the uh, west end of the map, um, there is uh, uh, four tracks. Two for uh, freight and two for passenger service. And that's working out really well. This is something I hadn't noticed before. I'd forgotten we'd even built it. Remember that little shack growler that was your uh, headquarters building? Yeah, it sucked. It was terrible. Well, here's your headquarters building now, Growler. <laughs> I had to move it because it was in the way. <laughs> but uh, Growler's Railway Empire. There you go, Growler. <laughs> that's that's pretty amazing, actually. Let's screen cap that. That was definitely worth it. We got fancy little ship, jet, and train thing here. No trucks, though. I guess trucks just don't don't make the fun uh, and those are some humongous doors I don't know how anyone opens them <laughs> but I thought that was pretty cool when I noticed it I s remember seeing these before in the game and it, I have no clue what these are is this a water fountain I don't know I don't know what these things are they are the strangest looking things it sort of looks like a water fountain all right, so today, what I would like to do, let's get this going again. Here, we'll take a look down at the corridor. Um, what I would like to do is finish up the southern corridor. Let's get it all the way out and connected to Romney, which was the last place we built. You can see all this stuff waiting to go on the southern corridor here. I'm probably going to be able to add another freight train soon. In fact, let's go ahead and add another freight train now. One clone there we go uh, I did have a slight problem at Huddersfield <laughs> because uh, when I'd replace the the steel trains coming out of here I'd have actually put put in state cars instead of Naffy's cars so they weren't able to pick up uh, uh, consumer goods and bring it back to uh, St. Austell so all the consumer goods were going down here to Alford which meant they all had to come back up here to uh, uh, Huddersfield to be distributed around the rest of the city. But that I fixed. So today, what we're going to do is we are going to complete the route from here. We're going to uh, add workshop. It's like somebody couldn't spell workshop. <laughs> add workshop and then connect it right up here to uh, uh, to uh, Romney. Huh. I, I guess they really are Mormons. <laughs> I was just joking, but there you go. <laughs> All right, here. Yes. So I think what we're going to do to start this off is let's go ahead. I'm going to pause this because otherwise it's going to want to replace things and... It, it just it seems to think that once you've deleted something it needs to rebuild it immediately <laughs> there we go I think that's okay but this is in my way so we're gonna have to redo this all right I do need a shed here so unless I have a shed somewhere else that'll fill the need for that because that's just going all the way up here. I have no shed there for that. Um, I could probably should put a shed on here for the wood, but I don't need the shed for the wood. I need the shed for the oil. Oh, we've got room. Yeah, let's put it here. That way I won't have to worry about having it in my way. Oh, no, never mind. 
<laughs> I have the other two routes here to worry about, too. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Enough of that. Oh, we got the new things in. I Actually, I think I have one platform of the new... From the new uh, stuff. Let's... Let's expand that out some. And... No, no, come on. There we go. And then we'll go ahead and connect that one to there. And this gets the shed out of the way. Yeah, it puts it way out of the way. <laughs> yes, but it's not in our way. So we're going to come along uh, here, and we're going to curve up north. We'll put a station in here, and then we'll connect up to Romney up there. Probably going to be more things we have to delete, but let's just get started with... Also, uh, Workshop will get our first new station. That's cool. All right, let's try right here. You know, it doesn't need to be that far south. Let's do this. Right there to right here. Okay, and then we'll go from right here into there. So we get just ever so slight curve there as we come through this area. Well, that wasn't what I wanted. And that was the wrong track. Bless <laughs> it. There. <laughs> I thought I'd connected to the top there, not to the bottom. Okay. And last but not least, this little section right there. Okay, so that's in place. Now, let's go ahead and replace or delete some of this road here because you know this is going to be a problem. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's just cut this all the way back to here. There. All right, let's. Yeah, let's do this too. Yeah, I know that's a main connection, and I just deleted it, but I will put it back in later. Alright, actually I'm going to get rid of that, and that, and that too. Now, let's go ahead and grab our flattening tool. Oh no, here he goes with the flattening tool again. Well, we need this area flat to work on, Growler. How many billions of dollars would that just cost, Growler? Um, looks like it cost you seventeen million dollars. Eh, how much of that of Growler's money? Growler, you've got fifty-seven billion, so shut up. <laughs> I don't know what you're worried about. All right, so station. We got our first one of the fancy new stations. I love it. So this is going to be pretty much a straight line there. We'll figure out how to do the curve later on. But I think this is the only way for us to really do this properly. So then we'll come out of here and we'll go up to that. We're going to still going to end up curving quite a bit to get to uh, do this. Okay, let's see. Let's put it... Boy, where do I want to put this? Let's put it right about here, I guess. Okay. Bootyful. Okay, I'll put the second track on here. Yeah, well, I would have loved it if I could have done... You know, I suppose one of these days I'm going to have to... I know I've done it before. But one of these days I'm going to have to get back into doing separate... Uh, uh, passenger and freight stations. Obviously, that's what the, they have in mind when they, whoops, when they uh, uh, designed the game. But I just always found it such a pain in the rear to do separate tracks. Okay, so we're gonna do this, 
and doesn't really matter uh, I'll put the passenger station right here oh these things are really huge so put one of those in and then one of those in but the cargo buildings haven't changed any <laughs> they still look really awful let's move these down here because I really don't want my beautiful passenger buildings to look like the same awful freight buildings we've had since the beginning of the game. <laughs> Can't freight buildings get updated to? Really, they should be more modernistic freight buildings at this point. I mean, they don't build buildings like this anymore. We should not be we should not be uh, seeing buildings like that. All right. All right. Enough complaining about that. Yeah, Growler would appreciate it if you'd shut the hell up. <laughs> Rude! Jeez, Growler. Okay, we'll run this down to here. And we'll run that up to there. And that can be where we reattach our road from up there. That'll be good. Okay. And let's get some of these roads reconnected. Oh, I have Curvy on. I didn't mean to do that. That looks pretty straight. And this is not going to work out. <laughs> Need to extend this a little further. There we go. Alright, that looks better. Um... Let's extend this down to here. That'll be a great line for our freight to take. I'll we'll extend this over to here. That looks fairly straight, I think. I'll go ahead and extend this one down too. That way all this neighborhood is all set to go here. Run that through. And I think we'll go ahead and run this one through too. And then I'm actually going to do this. Electric here. All right, so. Let's go ahead and actually, I'm not going to put anything there yet. I'm going to widen all of this. And this is going to be our public transit route. Come on. There. So our public transit will take this loop. And it'll come back and connect into this station here. Already got electric turned on. How about that? It's almost as if I know what I'm doing. We all know that's not true. Yep, there we go. And then we'll give you a building. Alright, so they'll be able to come out, just walk up the road a little bit, and uh, go right into there. Train station. Well, that's nice. Okay, and then over here, I think what we'll do is this. Let's, so this can do a little bit in the way of coverage, so let's put it, no, I don't need electric on here. Don't have cargo trams. Which, you know, since the game by default does not have cargo trams, it does make you wonder why the, uh, uh, um, the, uh, uh, cargo truck depots can, can actually do that. I could have gotten away with one platform, but that's good enough. All right, so that's good. That's all set up. I will get that done in a minute, but let's go ahead first and get these tracks in. 
So, come down to about there. That looks good. Nice straight line. Just one tunnel. Okay. And then we curve and connect to here. Did I get the right one? Yes, I did. Got the right one this time. We lose a lot of speed in that curve. I hate it, but I don't think we have anything that's ever going to go that fast. <laughs> I mean, even when we get the high speed ones that can do 300 uh, kph, assuming we were doing dedicated track just for passenger service, like we have over in uh, uh, on the main corridor, they never make it. They never make it to top speed, anyways. <laughs> Especially when they have to make a stop every once, you know, every, every, whatever. They just never make it up to their top speed. Okay, this here. That. That. All right. Let's get the details filled in on this. Okay, getting this all smoothed out a bit here. There we go. Good enough. I realized afterwards that this the, the southern corridor is not going up to Romney. Uh, the Romney branch here is going to continue down here, and the two will meet here. So I added another track on. I got all of this set up. We just need to put some vehicles on it. Let's grab some cargo trucks. Um, I'll put two on here. Looks big enough, it's going to need it. And this is Worksop, City Deliveries, and then Trams. Let's go ahead and put 10 on. And this is Worksop Tramway. Okay, so that's all set. Now we can go ahead and get the Southern Corridor connected. Uh, South Corridor. Okay. Thetford, and this is going to go out to there, and then back to Thetford before going to Driftfield. And then Southern Corridor Freight. It's going to go out to here, and then back to Thetford, and then there. Okay, so it's now added on to the Southern Corridor Freight. Uh, I do need to reconnect this road, and I think I can safely do that now. I don't think anything we're going to do now is going to change what we're doing here. That looks good. Um, was there anything else I deleted road-wise? I don't know if there was. Oh, yeah, over here there's a road I deleted. Let's go ahead and reconnect that. And smooth that out a little bit. That was messy. All right. Okay, so now um, let's go ahead and start this going again. So we can start seeing some stuff come up here. Now we just need to do a track connecting these and extend this branch line down here. Let's see what happens if I just try to run a track. Because there's not going to be any boat traffic here, so I don't have to worry about that. There. All right, so that's a nice smooth curve there. That's messy. I don't know why that's like that. Let's try doing this. Let's try crossing. Ah, I hate. All right, let's do this. Let's get rid of this road. Let's pause this again and get rid of this road. There. All right, now let's try doing this whole thing again. Do it as one long sweep here. A tunnel. I just want to lower it so it's not so much of a mess there. 
It makes that tunnel insanely long, though, if I do that. All right, let's... Uh, where is... There it is. Let's try doing this. We'll come out here. We'll come through here. So that brings our line up to there. Let's get rid of you. So we don't even have a tunnel at all if I do that. Uh, now let's... I need to do something here. So let's just create a little brown patch there so I know where I'm where I'm going to. Alright, so let's try this again. Grab this. So I'm going to about here somewhere. And it still doesn't want to put a tunnel in if I put it here. That is very, very strange. So now I get a tunnel or... or not. Alright, I think what I'm going to have to do is come from this side. Come from this side. We'll cross the river. Oh, look at that. That's a bit higher than I wanted. <laughs> okay, that's better. That's that's a bit closer to what I would like to see. Alright, let's go with that. And then we'll go this way and connect up to there. So we get tunnel there. The tunnel is still insanely long here. Can I... Well, that gets rid of the tunnel altogether. I have no problem with there being a tunnel there. I just don't want it quite so long. That's good. That's a decent length tunnel. Okay, so we'll go with that. Uh, no, it's not what I want. I'll go ahead and switch that, though. This is what I want. And yeah, I know I've forgotten to put my tails on things again. We've been getting away without doing it lately. Hopefully we can keep getting away without doing it. Okay. Now let's see if we got away with it. <laughs> Okay, right there looks good. Okay, that side worked. All right. So that all worked. Go ahead and grab this. And we'll do that. Then we'll do this. That's fine. I'm not going to mess with it too much. These are too close, but I'll get rid of them in a minute here. Okay, that looks good. Now, last but not least, let's reconnect this. How was that connected before? <laughs> oh, I didn't have uh, the uh, switch in there before, that's why. Get 
rid of that. Um. Nope, I want that straight. Go ahead and do that. And then let's go ahead and do this. And we'll curve this down to meet that there. Then we can go ahead and tr cross our tracks. No, stay level. Beautiful. Start everything going again. Romney Branch. So it only has two stops on it. It's going to get another one. What don't you like about that? Right there. To right there. I must have clicked the wrong thing by accident. Okay. That does happen. Okay. And then right here. And back to there. Okay, so everything's connected now. I really want to do some more smoothing here because all of this looks awful. Maybe I'll put in some more forest on there. Maybe that'll help. <laughs> uh... There. That looks good. That looks good. And I need to reconnect this. Not sure why I had a nice road going out to the quarry, but I guess the quarry workers really needed a nice way to drive out to their job. What am I still... I've got a train that's just unhappy. Okay, turn around then. I don't care. <laughs> Where are you anyways? Nope, that's not what I wanted. Uh, it's clear up here at uh, Bushy for some reason. Yeah, look at all the stuff going on the corridor freight. This is the only section of the corridor freight that isn't four tracks right here. And just because it's so long, it really doesn't need it. Stuff doesn't get backed up there. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab this and this. And can I... That's the wrong one. How about this one? That's the right one right there. You know, I never thought about the fact that I could just paint this stuff that's all yellow when I hate it. <laughs> oh, let's come back to assets. Got lots of lots of assets I haven't mucked around with much. Really need to play around with it. Size, brush strength. And we'll bring the forest a little further down the mountain here. I realize it's a different kind of forest. I just always use the mixed <laughs> the mixed trees one. But it still looks pretty good. I like it. Let's give it a little forest right here, because I think it could use a little something over on this side. And Eh, whatever, close enough. <laughs> I did sort of block the tree there, or block the track there, but... Eh. These people driving along the highway here should have themselves a nice forest to look at. There. Okay, so that's all nice. I love the look of the new station. I hate the fact that it really means I really need to go and uh, update the uh, 
I don't remember this piece connecting the building before. Was it always like that? Um, I hate the fact that it means I really feel like I need to go and update all of these now. And now I really hate... Uh, I, I really never paid much attention to it before, but now I really hate these, so I hate having them mixed. Next time, I think I will have to work on doing separate stations. Not this playthrough. I'm not redoing everything to give a separate freight and passenger stations. Not even sure how I will go about doing that, because that will be one hell of a mess, I'm sure. Uh, well, this is going, this is going to give us more tool and machine uh, uh, customers. Which is always good to have more customers. We might be the point where we could actually use another tool in another machine factory. Let's take a look at these real quick. Machine factory. Oh, I did this. I added uh, another track on here and connected it to this. Um, so that I just put a single train on delivering machines down here. So they can jump right on the southern corridor. So it helped take some of the weight off from uh, uh, this branch line. Um, and just, you know, move things along faster, too. We need something. We're not getting enough wood through. I accidentally cut off our wood delivery at some point. <laughs> uh, maybe I just need to... We're not getting all the wood delivered from the... This one here. Looks like he's not delivering everything. He's delivering almost all of it. Well, both of them are... Both of them are a little short. I couldn't see the wood. Zoomed back, I couldn't see the wood sitting there. Maybe... How many trains do we have on here? One. How many trains do we have on here? One. <sighs> Maybe cut the length of these trains down to about two-thirds and put a second train on. So this one had two trains on. Actually, I had a pass-through here for some reason. Why did I have a pass-through on here? <laughs> I had the setup to allow me to pass through. I bet you there was another forest up here I was going to connect to, and then by the time we got to it, that forest was gone. This one is just a single track. I might end up double tracking this and changing the uh, changing these out for shorter trains, but running twice as many of them, so we can try to get the the full output from our sawmill. And maybe that will help with this. And there's my voice. Um, but I think more likely we just need to get another machine factory going. And what was the other thing? Tools? That's right here. Uh, it's saying we're not getting it all delivered, but I have a feeling that's just because me mucking with things has ended up with some stuff getting deleted. Um, so that's probably fine. So we yeah, probably need another tools factory going too. And this is also saying we're not getting enough de uh, delivered. We need to fix this now. You can see <laughs> we have a lot of empty space on here. Uh, so this might be the next target of our upgrade uh, uh, operations. And then we can get this branch line going up here to Emsworth. And like I said, I'm going to leave this here for now. You know, this may be the basis of a north corridor route. We will see. So that would head over here to this and this. And we don't have any of the other northern branch lines. Right now, uh, uh, the Brosley line is the only northern branch line we have going. All right, let's hop on one of our new trains. Well, we didn't really have any new trains, but let's hop on this. Might actually end up needing to put... Uh, 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 put another train uh, of each type on here. We'll see how it goes. But that is it for today, guys. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please remember to tickle that thumbs up button. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Have a great day.